Well, as always, it is a pleasure being with you each and every Thursday. A very good morning to you. Thank you very much for keeping it Y254. This is Power Talk. My name is Ram Maguko. We are coming to you live from the broadcasting house here in Nairobi, Kenya. We are also live on our website at www.kbc.co.ke forward slash Y254. It is a very fine Thursday today, the 23rd of September 2021. Hoping that you're well this particular day. We have a lot in store for you in our conversation. It's all about mental health and campus life. For those who are about to join campus, it is September, September intake. There are those who are joining, about to join campus. You have no clue how you're going to go through that whole process. Are you a parent? Are you concerned about how your child is going to fare on during this particular season? Campus life has a lot. It has a lot. Mental health is an issue. People get into drugs when they're in campus. It is in campus when we've seen making headlines, people even killing each other. A boyfriend killing the girlfriend, a girlfriend killing the boyfriend. It is happening right under a parent's nose. What do we need to do to maintain our mental health? Drug abuse has been a, an issue for campus students. Have you seen or heard about campus students getting into drug addiction? This conversation is for you. You don't want to miss this particular discussion. Joining me to help us understand more about this, as always, I'm having fantastic guests. Leon Meleta, what will about how they cook a talk show? It's their first time ever, and I tell you, there are people that you would not want to miss hearing what they have to say. I'm joined next to me. Jim Wizzy. Jim what? Squeezy Rada Nikugota. Rada Nikugota. Yeah. Karibu sana baba. Shukran, shukran. Uh, he, he is an artist. You know him. Kumbe yeah. ni under 18. <laughs> kama, kama ni mezei. Uh. Kumbe ni under 18. <laughs> <laughs> and to my extreme right. Yes. I'm joined by none other than Anthony Njianga. Yes. He is a uh, counseling psychologist. Karibu sana Anto. Thank you so much. Mefurai sana maze kukuona. Tena the other time bana kuna conversation tulikuwa na yo. Na najua sahi tutayongelele ya vibaya sana. Tulichoma ama tuliwe. Ah, <laughs> tuliweza. <laughs> Tuliambia watu vile kuka. Unajua we talk real stuff. And this power talk, today mm. I'm so happy because mm. these issues na happen. Thanks, Kuna mzazi maybe a juu even is na happen. So mm -hmm. I'm so ready for this and, show. And this conversation, you yes. see one thing that you need to understand about this is mm. uh, mental health and drug abuse is one particular conversation that uh, um, is important especially this time. Yes. Both, both of my guests are uh, uh, you know, fighting. Mm. Uh, Helping us in the fight against drug abuse, yes. especially among the youth. We were in a mute man. Yeah. We mm. experience yako ilikuwa jevo ni ilikuwa kampo. Yes. Ata kama ukuwa kampo. Yoto ambi. Ilikuwa vipi. That's how it's part of show on Twitter. At Ram Maguko. At Y254 channel. So you can find us. Pia unaza pata kwenye mitandao. Jimot. Yeah, gym what edutainment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tuna educate na tuna entertain. Entertain at the same same time. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Catch him also gym what edutainment on uh, on his social media platforms. Yeah. Anthony. Instagram at official Anthony Njenga. A N T H O N Y N J E N G A N. Facebook Anthony Njenga. YouTube Anthony Njenga. Magnificent. Yes. This is a conversation that you do not want to meet. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, remember, this conversation also will have a repeat of this show at 10 p.m. Welcome. And this, as always, as I say, is Power Talk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, campus. I remember when I was in campus. <laughs> yeah. It was Jimwa. I didn't even do change position. Namadawa to a campo and get to a cole. 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 We, we were in high school, uh, campus unaitua, unajua, the, the, oh, the cream, uh, uh, cream uh, de la cream. Cream de la cream. Uh, sasa, kole, ni ambogi. <laughs> Kama kuitua yeah, kampo, yeah. unenda kole. They are good colleges, yes. yes. Okay, okay. But, you know, kole ni, so you, you fought for it. So, like, oh, una respect your zaidi, yeah. as in in campus. Because mm. ah. ulichaguliwa. Like so, kuna levels. They, they, unajua, kabile, also maga kwa, kwa, kwa fruit mm. ati our fruits are, are picked are, cho are chosen not picked not picked kuna zile upikiwa kuna zile kole but chosen ni campus <laughs> <laughs> na ndomo ambia mse ni poa uweke bd ndo at least upate a ama b plus ama hizo grades za kuitua campo yeah, yeah, so yeah, that yeah. you don't wow. have to do a bridging course and stuff mm. so okay miku unanjo kwa angu ziko the same mina itanga zote campus holy pass holy pass holy pass holy pass holy pass Oh, Milango zilikuwa zinafunguka. Kuna wale walipata wali maybe like maybe a C. 
yeah. na anataka kuingia campus, campus. same KU mm. ali have kwenda one year mm. pre campus like pre university mm. okay okay yes. bridging in bridging, bridging yeah. Yeah. yeah lakini life bado si the same yeah. kole university yeah. life ko the same ndio it depends with the job market because yes. mm. maybe wale watu wanaku wanaku admit job mm. wanaweza angalia standards if maybe staff ule ametoka university mm. ana do better okay. kuliko mse yuko campus atachukua ule mse wa you university because uh, uh, recommendations definitely yako yako iko the same campus na college Ka- is the same uh, definitely iko the same because unajua university vinya ametus amesema bana university ni kwa watu ma a ma b plus <laughs> colleges ni kwa wale watu the rest tunaitanga others <laughs> eh, lakini but uh, i think some of the issues zenye zina happen kole yeah. ni kama tu zenye zina happen yeah. kwa kwa campus. uni because hizo mambo na drugs yeah. zina happen hizo ma influence bado ziko the same same places i was saying i remember my time sasa ni sisi na campus now I'm, i'm afraid of saying campus sema tu sema tu tunakuruhusu tunakuruhusu tunakuru, tunakuru, sema tu let's say tertiary education uh-huh. <laughs> yes uh-huh. but your time when you likuwa na university mm. um, i remember kuna time when unajua kuna There's, there are those days that uh, we can in Zanga mm. and uh, in my school we can ni kwa Zanga Thursday Thursday yeah. Thursday you come like the same yeah. mm. na mashuka mm. na mashule zingine mm. but kifika Thursday ndio siku yenye unaona ma uh, ma student wanatoka shule wanaenda place zingine kulikuwa na place zingine hapo hivi kando ya shule sasa mm. sasa ku, ku, kuita yes. yo, yo jina malatu mess alafu Um, kama kuna gari kuna sana natoka na gari tunapata uh, magari zimejaa zimejaa alafu eh na naomeka mangoma inaitwa ngo parking lot pimping oh <laughs> mm, yeah sherehe inaanza sherehe na zanga hapo uh, um let's let's get it from the from from the get go um your opening remarks when it comes to mental health yes. for a campus student ama college student yeah. um anafaa fanya nini ndio akuwe na hiyo mental stability especially kapo kampo ama kama ko uni kama ko uni acha naanza na anto ah uh, vinya naweza sema ni ati unajua pia the first thing ram before before today ama mtu memeleza high school anataka kwenda kampo uh, the first thing is mbona what is your wewe uko na campus umeenda kufanya nini campus unajua the main goal wewe kwenda campus ni ku, ku study your career alafu after that uweze ku achieve whatever you want to achieve so number one thing mwenye maybe unanisikiza sasa hii ndio you are a youth man bado uja join kampo but umemaliza high school The first thing before ufike kwa campus before uadmitiwe ama uitwe mindset yako number one. usiende hapo na ile mentality ya ati oh campus kuna raha oh campus kuna mayengs wasichana ena na ile positivity ama ile mindset that unaenda kusoma mm. na una achieve career yako mm. once umeenda na hiyo mindset hata nini ki come through utaweza ku battle but unajua nowadays rama ram, um, mm. issues ni mingi mas today wakitoka high school wako na ile hype inaenda kampu mm. bana anaenda kuchafua huko sikaziwi na Peru ameenda ati anataka kuishi kwake ndio aende kuchafua mm. ma, ma nini ma housewarming mm. ameshaingia nini ya housewarming na mechapa sherehe 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 mm. hiyo ndio mentality wanakuangana wana so unapata hata mtu akiwa high school kama mimi nikiwa high school unapata nikimaliza high school nilikuwa na ile feeling ya eh life ya campus ni raha hakuna mali ati oh kuna ati oh hata kama nitasoma life ya campus hakuna kukaziwa na mapero Mm. So inakuwa ati the mentality ni ati unaenda campus kupiga sherehe au ni kusoma. Freedom yenye uko nayo. Yes. Enye, you know you're no longer under your parents uh, yes, yes. Uh, order. Na inakuwa ngambaya wakati yenye imekuingia uh, mm. in a way in a negative way that hauangalii the main purpose ya wewe kwenda. Mzazi ame sacrifice pesa yake hiyo mm. school fees ya wewe kwenda campus. Lakini wewe umeenda campus na mindset ya kupiga sherehe. Ukipiga sherehe utaweza uta kuconcentrate na masomo na unataka ku achieve your career. So number one thing to all parents to all uh, high school leavers from four leavers before when the campus before you were admitted mm-hmm. what's your mindset what is taking you there number one, what is taking you there is studying and achieving your career mm-hmm. but you can on a mindset yet unaenda kupiga sherehe unaenda kupata na madem au kaziwi na mapero unaenda kufanya mabash and every time kila kitu kayo mm-hmm. itakuwa very tricky for you to achieve what you've gone there to achieve mimi nakumbuka time ilikuwa tunamaliza from 4 and si kama ni naweza sema nilidanganywa jamaa alikuja akasema just finish high school the rest takwa nywe takwa nywe sasa mimi nika mimi nikawaka nikasema acha nijaribu hii KCC nione because nikiingia campus mm. ama nikiingia <laughs> shule mm. najua vizuri itakuwa tu kupita freedom mm. mm. we shock on me niliona vumbi <laughs> after one year ndio yeah. kani hit yenyewe this thing is serious yes. yeah. eh jimot yeah wewe unasema unakubaliana na kitu antena anasema um Jamaa ameto amemada shule uko kampo una feel to yani you have life thrown at you. Yeah na na naweza echo vile vile me respond because mm. kama sasa tuseme 
uki, uki enda kampo na mindset ya kukosa kushughulika na zile vitu zimekupeleka huko mm-hmm. utakuwa yani utakuwa hauko focused cuz musa maga una prioritize mm-hmm. not just in campus even yes. in life yes. like umeenda kampo kufanya nini kuso kusoma cuz kasa mimi nilikosa kusoma ile time maybe nilikuwa kwa class and everything mm. but nilikam kuingia colleges baadaye and everything nilifanya graphic design after nil take a break from music and everything mm. so chenye nil get from shule passe ukitoka primo si ati umetoka primo menda high school ilikuwa easier ina get actually harder mm. cuz ilikuwa ina ku prepare primary na ku prepare for kama sasa tuseme basic alafu unaenda secondary alafu yeah, sasa unaenda yeah, tertiary yeah. unajua mm-hmm. so hata ukiingia job usidhani itakuwa starehe kwa mm. mu imagine hata vile msewa ga employee ati nataka kuwa boss pengine boss akwa na pressure kuliko employee yes. mm. unajua mm-hmm. so like kila level unapanda iko na challenges, ina, ina challenges mm. zake yes, yes, so like yes. in campus kuna hiyo kitu wengi wasi wengi utaka hata wale wanataka kwenda sai freedom mm. so ile shida iko ni mm. ukipata hiyo freedom wasi wengi wako wagi prepared for it yes. unajua yeah, yeah. like unajua kama ujui like naenda hii njia na kuna njia mingi utaenda any anyway. Yeah. anyway so i think una ha, una have kujua mimi naenda target yangu ni like in in e semester nafaa kupata hii grade cuz mm-hmm. sitakai kufikia mm-hmm. wasi ni different kuna ule msifikirie long term goals mm-hmm. atafikiria nataka kupata zinaitwa first class honors mm-hmm. wewe unaweza kuambia kuna kuna wale si sema honors kuna wengine atasema honors sasa mimi mimi sio wenye tulikuwa nayo i was in the american system okay. of education yeah. asa ilikuwa unatumenga gpa oh, okay kuna sasa kuna hiyo gpa grade, kuna, grade point something yeah grade, grade point average oh, okay mm-hmm. yeah alafu kuna sasa hiyo honors first class yeah. honors second class honors ndio kwa ground hapa yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> alafu kwa gpa kuna ile uh, cum laude gamma nini uh, uh, summa cum laude magna cum laude asa hizo ndio hizo sasa umetupisha watu mpata mpata anza kuingia google translate sasa nataka nisikie story yenu because you've gone through uh, a tertiary education. Yes. Nini kwenye ilikuwa aje? Na um, for me niliingia camp, uh, campus na ile mentality niko free. Do you know what? Hizo semester za kwanza nili fail. Wow. Because bado haikuwa ime ni hit. Kulikuwa me relax sana. Me relax. Yeah. Na mimi kitu mm. yule mwalimu aliniambianga yes. at manza tu form 4. Like at, at no one fails in university. <laughs> you know ni yes, 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 yes. Ana fausi wa mwalimu. Okay, I should buy that job. And mm-hmm. no one fails in university. Yeah. Yeah. Shock on me. Sura yako ilikuwa jamaji kwa kampu. Mimi actually leta sahi niko college. Ana ndaita college ama institution because niko tika school of medical nafanya tika school of medical and health sciences mm-hmm. nafanya psychology. Mm-hmm. So bado niko bado niko shule na bado pia nilikuwa Mombasa Aviation nikafanya mm-hmm. media kidogo mm-hmm. media and mass communication. Yeah, yeah. So nikiingia nikifanya media because it was my first course eh, in 20 uh, 2017. Uh, mi mentality yangu definitely pia ilikuwa lazima hiyo pressure ikuwe nilikuwa naambiwa oh unakumbuka ramu kiambiwa ukimaliza okay, high school utalala vinyo unataka yeah, utafanya yeah. kinyo unataka mimi nilikuwa naambiwa eh? yes wake up now you will sleep later, <laughs> <You> sleep later. <laughs> so mimi uh, ilikuwa the same nilikuwa na ile pressure that nikienda campus uh, ama nikienda college itakuwa mm. itakuwa easy for me sitakuwa na my parents roof nitaka sita kaziwa nitakuwa naenda sherehe vinyo nataka juu nimepita 18 niko 20 naweza fanya kinyo nataka but uh, nilikam realize mpaka saa hii uh, it's not about the 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 fun ama the ile 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 raha part of it in in campus it's about what took you there number one mm. what took you there to campus maybe mwenye unanisikiza na uko pale kampo na ndo umeingia wewe ni fresher um, and uh, you in your first semester ama your first year uh, ndo hata hujamaliza semester moja na uko hapo unashindwa mbona hiyo pressure bana niko nayo uh, vitu zinanikalia ngumu nimepata units zingine ngumu sana it's all about your mentality just change twist ka mentality unajua mind yetu ina, ram ina, kuna venye you can twist it kama venye time kuna venye unaweza unclock it na uchange time mm. kama ni let's say saa hii saa yako inasema ni saa sita na kumbe saa hii ni saa tano unaweza i twist the same same way twist your mindset weke mindset ya what took you to campus what took you to campus is education na uangalie the fact that mzazi wako mahali ametoka background yako 
mzazi wako ame try all he or she can kukupeleka campus lakini wewe mindset yako ya campus ni uende upige sherehe hautakaziwa wasichana na kila kitu na ndio maana sasa unapata mavijana wengi first semester yake ashapata HIV and AIDS ashaingizwa kwa bangi influence influence so number one, mimi 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 nilikuwa na hiyo pressure but with time kakuja kuona uh, inakuwa wastage of time cause Aha, yes. hapo 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 mm, mm. with time yes. with time gani liku hit sasa vizuri ukaelewa wenyewe aki if i don't change mm. i'm going to mess up uh, time nilianza kuwa influenced mm. na remember nisha nisha kuwa influenced into nisiende classes unaona ile time una, una, una uko nyumbani ndio hujatoka unasikia class ime bounce Ujanda ta shule lakini class ime bounce unafurai so unapata unaenda mashughuli zako mabeshi unakuita out mnaenda mnajibamba mna tea mnafanya everything that you that you wanna do so ilini hit uh, later on hata saa hii hata vile niliingia juni nilikuwa shule Mombasa nikifanya media now uh, niko tika vile nilikuja tika unajua tika kuna mashule mingi sana a lot of schools are in tika yeah. na tika by the way Uh, it's a good place it's a very very nice place mm. na wewe usipoenda ukienda tika with a mindset ya kupiga sherehe uta, uta trust you me uko huko ndio raha wewe naishi uko <laughs> ndio uko ndio raha wewe na studio ameja i perform tika i think tika institute of technology TTI. 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 Eh. Eh, uko eh uko nimeperform nimeperform nime, nimefanya shows huko mm. so uko najua kuna raha kuna raha tika kuna But mashule ni mingi tu sana ujua like sasa ile kuna hiyo event mm. tuseme kani cultural week kama yes. something unajua mm. sasa hiyo wamekubalishwa mm. because oh, okay. one thing mimi nililearn okay. nililearn hata na ku, ku have fun ni unajiri reward after we achieve yes. unajua mm. like mm ni ngumu kuambia msia ati ngoja hadi saa ile utamaliza high school, high school. Uh, campus ndo yeah. so hata unaweza unaweza jipatia kama vile muambia msia either in campus ama ako job ama nini mm. like at least function yes. weekday like, like you, monday uh, to friday uko uh, uh, soba ama uko mm. uko focus uko na chenye unafanya yeah. alafu weekend unaweza jitreat lakini shida ni yeah. msia anataka ku enjoy throughout but uh, 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 anaka ile ngoma yenye anasema allow me to enjoy myself <laughs> <laughs> but hata mwenye aliandika hiyo ngoma mwenye alimba hiyo ngoma hakuimba akiji enjoy alikuwa job unaona hey, mm-hmm. so yeah. mkisikia sasa hiyo ndo anaenjoy but kuna time alikuwa focused na andika hizo mistari yeah, na study yeah, vile watu yeah, enjoy yeah, yeah. so like kama watu wengine huaga wanapitia struggle pia mm. utahab kuipiti kuipitia cause always appreciate success ama reward mm. kama hujapitia struggle unajua mm. kila kitu ungekuwa kanyoe hata ungekuwa ah unaboeka hata saa ile una have fun mm-hmm. but uta enjoy hiyo fun saa ile yes. una una, una, una deserve. No deserve so 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 we kwa hiyo ndio time uka change after yeah. when things are not going on well yeah 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah ilikuwa ilikuwa pressure mingi sana ilikuwa na pressure every every single person mwenye anaingia campus hata kama ni first year pressure inakuanga yeah, yeah. pressure Laki, inakuanga yeah, lakini with time utakuja hata kama not immediately yeah. but kuna lesson itakufunza unajua kuna kuna lesson campus inakufunza Mm. Lesson nyingine noma sana. Hata kama utakuwa na influence ya wasi mabeshi ata ku influence, muende mujibambe, muvute ma, ma, ma nini mangwai, ma nini muende muchape, ma, mashashola nini nini mujibambe, lakini at some point itakuja kuku hit that now you're spoiling your life. Na mimi mwambia my youth man, maze kama uko hapo sasa hiyo ni cheki. Maze uki, ukiaribu life yako sasa uko kampo. Umeingia kampo au utakuingia kampo. Ukiaribu life yako sasa hii, usipo achieve dream yako, usipo achieve mm-hmm. career yako. Mm-hmm. Itakuwa tricky uko nje because unajua sisi my youth man when you unanisikiza sasa hii ndio tuna build the future generation. Na inakuwa mm-hmm. tricky sana ukispoil sasa hii. Uh, Jumot, yeah. chani kama kwako. Uh-huh. Experience yako kwenye uh, ulikuwa uh, you know uh, shule mm. alafu you know that, that whole aspect of you know your mental health when you ilikuja ku uh, you know kukua during that whole period when you ulikuwa na shule. Ilikuwa ngavipi? Primo ilikuwa fun sana because mm. actually Primo ni me Primo ndo nilikuwa naishi nilikuwa naishi kwa quarters mm. my mom used to work there she was, she, she was the matron she's the matron there mm. so ni ile uko home unajua mm. so Primo was fun yeah high school was a big uh, ilikuwa challenge unajua sasa umetoka ile zone kila kitu ati um, 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 kila kitu iko tu hapo hakuna mtu mwenye anakubalia nilikuwa na shinda ni insist eh acha by the way ili nipe challenge because Primo ni chop Sando ni niende high school poa. Uli, ulipita Primo. Primo nilipita cuz okay. nilienda provincial hiyo time. Okay, nilienda uh-huh. Chinga Boys in Nyeri. Uh-huh. So ukisa ile tulitoka Primo umeenda high school, ukienda high school unajua wameselect wame wale kama upper average cuz uh-huh. provincial sala kuna national. Uh-huh. So provincial ni watu wako po, poa. Po. So auja relax sana cuz kama Primo kuna kama number 15 ama 20 Mm-hmm. pale wametoa kila mtu kutoka country yeah. so uki relax uta, utaanza ma 30 au yeah, unaona yeah. naenda 40 unajua cuz mm-hmm. hizo shule zina watu wengi yeah, yeah. yeah. so pale unajua utaab ku pull up your socks vile mm-hmm. tulikuwa tunaambiwa literally mm-hmm. una pull off una pull up your socks but kitu ilikuwa challenge in high school 
ni that as in ni kama inakufunza kuwa aman let's say if it's a boys school cuz kila mtu anajitegemea hiyo shule ilikuwa na nickname inaitwa barak mm. like kila kitu unajifanyia and everything mm-hmm. and kama ni kuamka mnaamka asubuhi mm-hmm. inakufunza inaku prepare for life kwa responsible kwa responsible mm-hmm. so kuingia at first nikaingia usani but nilienda kole kuingia kole nilikuwa equipped to face hizo vitu from the school of life mm-hmm. that's why move move ita kama gym at edutainment mm-hmm. cuz musa ma life pia ni kama shule mm-hmm. una learn mm-hmm. a new and a new thing yes. so musa maga siku yangu nikikosa ku learn a new thing ni kama nimelalisha unajua mm-hmm. cuz ndasikiza kitu kwa yake ndasikiza kitu kwa yako nitagatha alafu za improve life ya yeah. life yangu mm. so bado naendelea ku improve na zile vitu nili nili learn nazo but mm. chenye amesema ni important mm-hmm. foundation ina mata sana so kama e time umse anafaa kuingia kampo inaka time fupi ama ndefu kulingana na ma- mental perspective yako mm-hmm. but time ita fly semester moja imeisha mbili tatu nini na hiyo period unaweza do a lot it impact future yako mm. so uh, you know in time time when you mtako campus kuna yeah. time when you, you you begin to lose it for most people yeah. or for some mm. so Tapata, ni pressure ni pressure ya studies ama pressure ya hip exactly exactly because hapo ndo mental health inaingia sasa yes. Yes. kuna pressure ya kila kitu kuna pressure ya, ya studies mm. kuna pressure ya mabeshte wanakombea yeah, yeah, tishie pressure. Pia pressure mm. do mu itaga bia pressure <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Pia mm. pressure bado ni bia pressure bia yeah. pressure yeah. Yeah. now unapata you know that when someone's mental health is challenged sasa yeah. una get you get into drugs yes. you get into a uh, bad company yeah. you get into uh, you know stealing yes wengine wanaingia kwa magenge hiyo time mm. and na, na, mostly mingi hizo uh. uanza zinaanzia from hiyo drug abuse drug abuse yeah, cause yeah. kama mimi vile nili research juu ya drugs mm. and everything mm. kuna drugs that go get with drugs yes. like watu wanza pole pole sana yeah. mtu anaanza na fegi mm. that's why hata mtu huyu fa kukaziwa zile vitu anafanya wrong because mm. ukianza na fegi uivutange kidogo kidogo mm. by the time unafika age flani utakuwa umegraduate fegi kupata ile stim, stimuli effect mm-hmm. that's when one upgrade to ile fegi ya wazee mm-hmm. kama alianza na bia kidogo ameachana na bia brown bottle ameenda kwa ma, ma spirits so, and vodka so unasema unasema okay kuna maporo wengine wenye wanapatia watoto anasema baba baba shika hii anasema <laughs> oja kidogo I, so I, I, i think you're risky very risky cause cause mm-hmm. una unafanya huo mtu hii aone isi mbaya unajua risky yeah si same uh, stigmatize mm, mm. but at least muambie mm. angalia wale watu unaweza takuwa mi muambie mse angalia role models wako exactly. au is reckless yes. ama ni watu wako na wako na discipline yes. because through that you are training them mentally yeah. Yeah. to accept certain things acceptable. unajua pia mzazi ni role mzazi huyo mzazi ni role model huyo mtu huyu so ukianza mm. kumpatia vitu kama tia unje kidogo ama kafigi unje kidogo ama hata siku mpea unaiwacha tu hapo unajua sika nini youth man akifika age kama 20 ama 18 na anataka ngaku try vitu wako wa try maybe alikuwa nakaziwa so akienda mahali au anaita fegi ameachwa chini msema ameichapa na kaiwacha chini atachukua hiyo fegi aende a light as give lane hiyo feeling ita inakuwa na from then hapo atakuwa na, anapata ile ana, anakuja kujua hey, hii kitu wenyewe inaweza na alafu anza kusikia harufu fulani na ka harufu ya bangi ana hii bia harufu si si sigare bocha ni try the same thing amesema na agree na vile amesema una upgrading from something ile ile kitu wenye ume anza nayo uh, unaenda ngao kiupgrade alafu ram unajua must today pia campus bro uh, mental health inaingia wase wanakuwa depressed mm-hmm. social media pia inachangia mm-hmm. pia influence inachangia mm-hmm. uko pale ka ujui company ya ujui mabest wewe ni mgeni campus yeah. ujui vile ali grow background yake exactly mm-hmm. wewe ni mg- yeah nataka na, na, tukuje hapo we'll come there yes. but first tuangalie kuhusu these triggers mm. these things that push people towards there towards because kama how well if you don't understand these things mm. there is a reason why things happen yes yeah unapata mzae anakuja unapata mtoto hapo hivi unapata anafanya kitu alafu anamchapa mm haujui kwa nini amefika hapo mm. you don't want to let that so yes. i want to get about those things because i remember those are time i was in uh, uh, primary nikao mm. mtoi nilienda kwenye baba yangu anko yangu mwingine <coughs> nikapata mikunywa ameacha kanini hapo <laughs> kidogo eh kombe nikasema ah, ini chani jaribu jaribu yule mwenye nakaa 
na ilikuwa kwa glass nyingine wanakunywa yeah. na gizeli ma glass bigi 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 eh sasa nikaenda nikachukua nikaingiza kwa mdomo eh kali kali there are those triggers that you know push people yeah. uh, you what in your experience when you um, um, interact na my youth hapa nje si ndio umeona vitu gani zikuwa zina push out because wewe pia unajua uko na story yako yeah most, mostly i think challenges mingi ukuja na expectations mm. yes. maybe tseme uki, ukiwa primo mm. wase wengi wanasomea primo wako na class moja ya kila mtu. Yes. Like unajua huu mseni ni ibat sema ama mnajua like unajua background yake. Mm-hmm. But ukienda kama high school, sema kama ulikuwa unaishi Nairobi alafu ulienda high school kama coast ama sema ulienda western, unajua watu wametoka from different places. Mm-hmm. So sema sema kama saa mimi vile nilikuwa nyeri, kuna watu wame grow vid different. Yes. Huo huo mtu alikuwa anaonjesho hata akiwa mdogo, alikuwa okay, kunywa pombe ni ni kawaida. No. Yeah. So kuna vile out deal na hiyo hii Mm. But sema kama wewe ukipeleka hizo challenges home ni kitu mpya. Unajua hawatajua ati hata vile wata deal na unaona. Mm-hmm. So muse maga like ji ground na zile virtues ume grow nazo. Yes. Mm. Cuz mostly mujo wase wengi maybe wali grow from normal homes ama hata place kulikuwa na kama mnaambia this is right this is wrong mm. kama ulienda Sunday school unaambia be polite mm. don't don't indulge don't, in don't, don't, negative yeah, yeah, unajua. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Like Angalia hata kwa society kuna ule msemu msema gastaki kuwa kama umse but mm. unafanya zile vitu umse anafanya yeah, so kama alienda injia na una pitia injia una expect to turn up wapi we, we, we background yako ilikuwa aje because i know unaweza usanii vizuri yeah ukaenda ukatoa mangoma zika hit bye <laughs> hadi sahi under 18 eh? kama vile alisema yeye ni anasomea kwa psychologist na mimi yeah. namtambua kama psychologist cuz nimesikia talk zake and everything hapo mm. nilikuwa na reverse oh, mimi interact before yeah. social media vile unasema media tu mm. unajua mna interact mnajuana na mjuani oh, yeah, 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 yeah. so kabla alikuwa anasema psychologist mm. nilikuwa na hiyo time nikiandika na team na reverse reverse psychology mwambie mm-hmm. kitu like hizi kata unajua huku ground ile vibe kiswahili cuz tukienda gabash mostly wa so grown trends zile wako nazo yeah. kienda gabash tulikuwa tume notice kama saa tuseme mimi nimetoka dago sasa za kikuyu iko karibu na dago alafu kuna karen mm. so ini life ya maodi saidi yetu saidi ya karen ni ya mapunk mm. unaona mm. life ya odi ebu, okay. life ya odi okay. Le, leo shege na ilitwanga <laughs> off ana <laughs> vile <laughs> nini bro kuna vitu vitu vingi mnasema za nipita si you my young my fangs you my odi basically odi ni ordinary 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 mtu ordinary yes mtu mtu ameishi tu hii maisha anajua kibanda si odi dance but odi dance ilitoka hapo from ordinary yes from ordinary, Odi, mm. od, ordinary. Uh, yes. okay uh, so unasema kuna part ya odi yeah so na tseme part... dago yeah. ama side ya kaita on kikuyu mm. ni odi mostly mm-hmm. but karen ni a bit reserved unajua ni watu wameji wamejijenga mm. okay so watu kitu kitu happen kwa society mtu wa karen atakuja mm. side na si tuta meet pahali unaona mm-hmm. so uta learn vitu zao na si tuta no, learn yeah. so tulikuwa tukionaga mse kwa bash kama tseme tuito bash ya karen yeah una unaona wako na drinks class unajua anaweza afford mimi mmechanga yes. kubai mzinga nyinyi mm. watu kumi mnategemea moja ile ile big <laughs> eh au anakuja mtu mmoja na yake ile big <laughs> so unajua iko ile like ah si mimi nataka tu company you can you can share this yeah, yeah. unajua so tu, tulikuwa na ile design yeye yeah, anash, anajaribu kunywa yetu uh-huh. maybe ni cheap na sisi tuko like eh hey, yao kwanza tunapigana tot jo hata kwa club tunaweza afford tu tot hata uh-huh. hiyo chupa but yeye anakunywa hii yetu vile tu tunakunywa yake. Na hivyo kidogo dogo ndio mlikuwa mnaanza tu. Eh mnaanza hivyo. So utaget hata huyu mtu ulim, ulim growisha Karen anaweza ku affected na hizi drugs. Yeah. Cuz drugs mm-hmm. will affect kila mtu kila society. Mm-hmm. Shida ni ku handle stress. stress. I think you ndio issue ya ku dependent na drug abuse. Asa, f- f- for you in your story. Yeah. It started because of peer pressure. How did it start for you? Um I think I hadn't vi- I, I didn't have a vision. Mm. Unajua ile vile mtu usema kaende kaende unaishi tu mm. unaamka unaenda. Mm. So hata nikihit nilikuwa tu naamka nenda studio na toa ngoma alafu niko kwa TV na perform. Some money kakam. Unajua fame fame unaweza handle. Yeah. Sasa unakujua. But it came fame and fortune. Hiyo ni a bit tricky mm. kwa sababu watu wanajua uko na kaki. Kaki tu. So watu mm. interact mm. na yeye ile jimu hizi nile ai mzito mzito bazu unajua toa, like toa. kuna hadi heshima watu hata kabla cha cha meza kabla hata ifike kwa toa toa hmm. inakuwa ile wanaku wa, wanaku wanaku wana treat vizuri hmm. sasa unasikia enyewe <laughs> juu niko na do unaweza unaweza entertainer unajua hivyo yeah. hata ndio mufikiria politician waga 
anazirusha tu though yako na target na pole pole hivyo ndo unaingia kwa kwa addiction cuz musa maga when you break down addiction it's a habit unajua yes. like ishu moja na habit a habit is like a disease zile vitu tulifunza hata science ama nini a habit is a disease cuz mimi nimezoea nikiamka naendaga na toa lock unaona mm. so oh, kila siku eh sasa unajua useme kama ulikuwa unakunywa weekends mm. weekend ita ita graduate kwa weekday yes alafu weekday mm. ita, ita graduate kwa daily mm. sasa uta get ikifika point ukiamka kuna kitu unasikia kuna kitu na miss nikaa kunywa breakfast mm-hmm. so unapiga take aki mchezo with time itakuwa mwili yako inaitisha hiyo te umeje na kumkala walimu walikuwa wanafunzaga alafu wanatetemeka maybe kama hajatoa law yeah, nini yeah, yeah. zile vitu tulikuwa tunazina happen ya sisi na happen ya wase sai mm-hmm. cause mwili yake iko na hiyo withdrawal effect yes. mm-hmm. ina need ile kitu kutetemeka eh, sasa ina need ile kitu unifanya stable unaona mm-hmm. cause unaona gata tsemi hataka ni mekani kama nani maybe afanye job yake poa but akipiga ka flash ako stable hadi anachangamka unajua mm-hmm. like kabla ifike hiyo level kuwa uki watch like kama tuseme vile nilikuwa nasema moderate kama ni ku have fun have fun weekends cuz hata nakumbuka shule pi ilikuwa ina come once once haikuwa daily ni pi kweli kuna zile times huwa gatu kwa class ni exactly. science ni maths mm-hmm. ni theory mm-hmm. ni geography mm-hmm. ni nini but pi mna ingojea jumla relax mna unwind mm. inatoa stress so hata happy unaweza imeki kweni kitu unajiri word wezi jiri word daily yeah. so for you the trigger was money It, w- it was money and lack of a vision and structure na pia kuna hiyo kuna hiyo issue ya stress cuz you are famous mm-hmm. and you aren't prepared for it yeah. so when you go somewhere like unaona kasa nikikaa hapa na jua umse tutongea tu na yeye mm. but nikikaa hapa na tuseme ni place public kila mtu ananiju mimi si wajui mm-hmm. so nita have kuongea nao na si si yani si leave your zone wow <laughs> Umeskia story yake. Umeskia story and, yake. And it's interesting. Everyone has their own triggers. Yes. In your, kwa experience yako, mm. ni vitu gani huwa zina trigger wa say uh, you know to get into drug and drug abuse because peer happen yes, in yes. a challenge mental health. Mental because health. I, be, I, I believe if someone is uh, well oriented, vijimo watu wamesema kama uko na vision. Vision na structures. Na structure. Yeah. Kama uko nayo kuna venye hawezi yumba yumba. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Kitu kitu nimelana hata ni ni watch motivational speakers. Mm alisema you can either suffer two things the pain of discipline mm. or the pain of regret yes so kwa wow. discipline itafanya later on in life regret mm. Mm. exactly that's very true mm. i agree na venye jimota amesema na wenye wako na masikio fanya nini masikio <laughs> cuz it's true if you lack vision number one, triggers a uh, get into into uh, drug and substance abuse number one, if you if you don't have a vision and strong principles unajua pia uh, ram kila mtu ako na principles zake kila mtu ako different yeah. alafu unajua if you if you are a person mwenye you are swayed in unajua upepo bendera ina, inafuata nini upepo, upepo. so wewe ni kama wewe ni yule msemu mwenye ukiambiwa twende huku unaenda <laughs> yani wewe hauna hauna msimamo hauna structure people influence ya watu inakufanya umove lakini mm. if you want if you have a strong principle kama uko vision oriented and you're looking uh, to the future na unaona uh, you, you have a great future ahead alafu uh, you you feeling so positive that one day you're going to achieve whatever you want to achieve trust you me his triggers it are very another thing peer the main main thing the major thing that they say in a trigger was to to me drugs to get into mental health vitu kama depression which in a cause suicide mm. ni vitu kama peer influence peer influence ina kuja peer na social influence social influ- influence hapo na ongea story ya social media wewe uko hapo kijana umeingia high school sa au umeingia campus sa hizo umetoka high school umeingia campus uh, uko pale uko uko, uko, uko na simu kali sana cuz unajua sasa maybe ukiwa high school kuna kaziwa oh, usikuwe na phone but sasa umeenda campus uko na the latest phone hata kama ni iPhone au whichever phone uko pale social media umeona mse fulani uh, let's say umeona rama amepiga hapo suti moja polite eh mm. amepiga hapo pamba moja polite kiatu umetulia <laughs> place ako ako na amepigwa picha na ndai moja nuku <laughs> imekubali so uko hapo una feel maybe uko campus and uh, you wanna achieve ama you want to get what ramas get but one thing you should understand unajua uh, these things don't come easily na hapo ile influence ya social media mm. inafanya anga wase wa kuwa na stress unajua vinyama amesema uh, uh, nimekubali sana pia stress inaweza cause one people to get into drug and substance kuna, so, so kuna connection kati ya drug abuse drug and substance abuse na mental health yeah. Yes. It is a drug and substance abuse is a mental health illness. Apo. Sema yes. tena. Drug and substance <laughs> abuse is a mental health 
illness. Jimwe unakubaliana na historia hiyo statement? Mimi nililand the hard way. Nikiwa rehab, niliambiwa. Like hata usisikie like unajua mtu uji stigmatize yes. unasikia worthless and everything oh una feel kama how uh, like, you, you're not uh, worth anything like bora watu wana fit in kwa society vizuri na, na mimi si siezi so mm-hmm. unaambiwa it's like a disease unajua addiction is a disease yes. ni vile si disease per se because mm. ni ugonjwa wa kujiletea mm. but ni ni ugonjwa cause uta have to accept si wewe unataka kuwa hivyo si wewe mm. unataka ku, kulewaga usahau kulewaga u lose job yes. mm-hmm. kutumia staff alafu inakufanya una kuwa disrespect to your parents and everything yeah, yeah, so yeah. ni kitu uta have kuanzia one one thing na sema nikiongea na mtu msee ni dm ama nini mm. akwambie hey, maybe move uta sana uliezaje kuacha ama mimi kunywa sana uliezaje kuacha mm. kitu ya kwanza mu appreciate kama ame reach out hiyo ni kama step moja ya kuwa accept ana yeah. need recovery that you need help because wase wengi mm. wako in denial yes mm. unajua defense so, mechanism yes ukiwa yeah. in denial awezi progress cause unashinda go ki postpone yes na hiyo kesho ifikagi unajua mm-hmm. vile kitu nilikuwa najaribu kufikiria na na addiction nika vile mse usemaga ah wacha leni kunyelewa nitaacha mm-hmm. maybe next week unashinda go ki postpone lakini like, unajua umesema hii ni hii ni kaa ugonjwa yenye mtu anajitakia <laughs> not in a bad way okay okay yeah but, but, but i get you you're, una, not you're, you're not forced yeah. you umeendelea lakini like, unajua kitu yenye um, one thing that that is also um, I, i'm getting in this conversation mm. in the moment you like the feeling in the moment you feel like nataka ku you know ni kule ni nivute hii ni kunywe hii at that moment but kuna ile long term effect uko sasa ukifika uko mbele sana you know effects the fault in avenue ulianza the problem is kila mtu ni different kutoka genes and everything yes so awezi jua kama inaendea huu mtu anaweza kuihandle kama huu utaiha unajua so ni tricky so msemaga eh like karada like wewe unajijua wewe mwenyewe cause kuna kuna vile ninge ningeenda niambie unajua uta reach out to family ama niambie kazo eh maze mimi hata juu juu nataka kuacha tea si naweza naweza tumia hiki tunaweza vuta ile nasikia ni toshashi si mbaya nini nini akaniambia mbona nikamwambia ah juu wasanii wengi wanavuta na wako sawa akaniambia wewe ni hawa wasanii nikamshozi mbona basi unataka kuwa sawa wengine unajua una sometimes una pense real talk yes that's why ni lisema ni kama ugonjwa wa kujitakia and and that's and that's real talk is what people don't get yes hakuna mtu atakwambia ukweli that mm. this is actually bad yes. Yes. that he hata kama unataka kuifanya itakumaliza yes. yes. hata inaweza hata kakuwa kuna yeah, unfortunately kuna watu wamededi addiction some i know hata kabla ifike hiyo level ya suicide related illness unajua kama alcohol will affect liver because kama mimi kitu nilikuwa najua ile time nilikuwa nimehit kama rock bottom it's a bad state nilo naamka asubuhi una need to kunamb hiyo feeling unajua mm. so ulikuwa unatoa lock unajua ile unapiga kama ni quarter unaipiga flash ni kama si kali unakumbuka ukipiga hiyo kikombe ya nguo yako vile ilikuwa kali ile una shirini ile ilikuwa mbaya yani <laughs> niambia umefika level ya addiction uh. una need to kitu ingia kwa mwe hiyo mm. sote usikini kali unaweza kuwa una smile ukiongea na mse so the when rehab ilikuwa ilikuwa voluntary ama ilikuwa because you know some people outside here wapata mtu analoke analoke tu kwa room the people get forced yeah. into, into it. Yeah. Yeah, I, I actually know people who have gotten forced hmm. but yangu ilikuwa voluntary because I want to change but auko ready to have your conversation na maybe your your, your folks uh-huh. ama uh-huh. the people who are close in your life uh-huh. so wanaona sasa ile uko sober uh-huh. uko poor but uko poor unajua kuna withdrawal symptoms sio ndo kitu mbaya na addiction umezoea uh-huh. mwili imezoea kutumia hiki kitu yes. so kuna watu wito functioning alcoholics Mm-hmm. That person akikunywa moderately anaweza fa- function. function. But kama mimi tuseme case yangu reason ilifanya niache na Mungu alisaidia nikaacha sikuwa na limit like ni kukunywa. Unajua una get tipsy unasikia nyingine moja, nyingine moja, nyingine moja hadi unazima. Siku hizo wanaita unasema gani kuzima? Kuzima eh. Yeah. Ejana kuliendaje nini? Yaani ukumbuki unajua. Vitu <laughs> 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 yeah. Alafu na para zimu mara unaenda kwa tusi landlord. Eh eh eh. Na kwa mbaya sana. Mangori, alafu mm. unajua blanda ni ukifanya noma moja unataka kusahau hiyo noma. So yes. kesho ukiamka unaamkia ile nyingine. Eh uh, like una una, una, una dig shimo unaenda deeper deep, deep, deeper, deeper. So when you're getting out it's not an overnight thing when, yes. when you're being rehabilitated. I want us to I want us to look at different scenarios sasa. Now, 
let me start with one one scenario mm. in campus the part our say anaza ku date um uyu um say ana date huyu and um, in that whole process yeah. unasikia mtu mara amepigwa shock mm. ako kampo wasio nyamu those guys that you've had getting killed they yes. are campus girls mm. Those who kill, the campus men, yes. campus women, people who are still in school, mm. iwe, 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 iwe institute, when you are now one, mm. you know, how is it that they get to that position? Unasikia msea medinyonga, anafika haji yo level enye, na ako shule, ako campus, ako college. Do, yeah. do, like do, ni msea yangi, yani ni msea yangi, yani ya kuna so much life. Kuna potential. Unangoja kusia tu graduation. Uske tu, ah, Antonio na graduate. Mara, the next thing, bala kuna poster graduation, ni poster ya. Ni sad sana that's why mu like platform kama hii yes. cuz ina ina mm. tukiongelea hii story ume mention hata hiyo mse ana dead ana dead ama ana wa mse ama nini yeah. so mse mwingine atafikiria nyenye hizi vitu ha unajua yeah. kuna zile vitu ungeona kwa kuwa movie than hizi vitu ni ni kwa act mm. fiction eh yeah. mm. yani vitu kwa ground real bana ni real ni real ni real ni real kuna time ilifika like vile mu coping mechanism yangu mm. stay ku, kujige stress mingi mm. so hadi kuona news ni depressing cause ni sad unajua cause una, unasikia um say uko age una, una relate nayo unajua yuko like 20 something uh-huh. alafu unashindwa um to probably alikuwa na future nyingine yani ange alafu unajiuliza alifika aje hapo i think the stress alijaribu ku compress stress na na, na, na substances exactly. alafu uh-huh. likalipuka and that is the, the thing that we are going to talk about after this break different case scenarios relationships mm. after this break suicide yes after this break depression yes what is it that we can do to have that mental stability that we need when we are in college when we are in campus na pia after this break as a parent what is your role kama mzazi kusaidia in this conversation Let's take a short break we'll be back in a bit. This is Power Talk. Why 254? Imagine. Keep tweeting, keep texting the hashtag as always is Power Talk show at Ram Aguko at pa, uh, Y254 channel and sure that you also tag our, uh, our team members here you know kwenye uh, mitandao uh, G- at what edutainment gym what edutainment for power talk tuna get talk ya power uh, talk of, ah <laughs> yes sir tuna get talk ngoma hapo fresh fresh official at, at official uh, anthony njenga pale instagram uh-huh. yes and ensure that you also use the hashtag power talk show head over to facebook if posted a question on our facebook page i shall be sampling a few of your comments as we continue with this conversation in a bit and remember it's all about understanding mental health and the campus life mm-hmm. how do we have mental stability for our children as youths tafanya aje ili tukue na hiyo mental stability because we need peace and at the end of the day we all need to make it hakuna mtu anataka ku fail kwa life mm. how can we make it because if anything if anything our parents our guardians they are those who are looking up to us when you have expectations of it to care now uh, before we took that break we were talking about drug and drug addiction now i want us to take different scenarios um why tuguzie kitu hapa hivi mm relationships tumesema mm-hmm. jamaa na huwa mse mwingine relationships wa gani topic moja na, na shangaa hatari sana <laughs> uko kampo unaja kuna mtu alin advice yeah. yeah. but when you are in campus don't date anyone mm-hmm. in, in, in that campus ama eh, just cuz you are was our campo maybe out there too kondani though you you later issues sana cuz everybody knows your story yes yeah. so mkiachana inajulikana inajulikana hadi mna avoid ya na mko class moja si ana sisi kwa kwa shule yetu unajua unajulikana wote unajuana hadi unajua pale hostel yako hostel gani mpiachana best yako tena ana mhanya ana ana take over you pay you pay oh bye child na kwa chuki sana yeah is it except kuna uchu mwingine yenye tunakoanga so how should mtu anafaa handle large campus relationships kama uko kole gym what opinion i think i think in college ni ku lower expectations because what happens like When I was in college mara ya kwanza sikumaliza cause ya music 
So sayo si priority zangu wezi kuwa poa. But nilirudi badai after rehab and everything. Mm -hmm. So your time nilikuwa mostly a mature student because my daughter had already been born and everything. Mm -hmm. So nilikuwa mature student. So ata ninge kuwa na mingle na our, our students tuko nao, mm -hmm. uta notice kuna vile, kama we ni mse umeshanza ku earn, like ume, ume raise bar kwa ase mnasoma na? Nao. No. No. Ata kamu kuklasi moja. Ata kamu kuklasi moja. Amuko level moja. Amuko level moja. Though pia on the flip side, anata ku interact na umtu anahasol na endo wa hasol pamo? Pamoja. Pamoja. So nasema una lower expectations, like priority. Vile alisema, shugulika na focus na chenye ili kuleta huko. Mm -hmm. Wanta kupata grade poa. Kwa unajua mkito waka kampo, kila mtu watenda kivya. Kivya yake. Kivya yake. Yes. Wasa wengu date kampo ni few wale uwagawe, wanaenda po wali maria. Wali maria. Very few. Very few. Na yore kitu na danganyanga watu hapa njia, unasema, ah, siya kina nani, they, they started when they were in campus, pia sisi tunaweza kika yore. 25% actually, 25% ndo uwa wana, wana, wana yeah, endingi hapa moja. Yes, 20, 25% ndo wana endingi hapa moja. Cause, una, uta danganyo bana vile uliambio hati, hey, eh, usi, usi, ina, ina depend pia na mtu ramu. But what I'd say is this, eh, kudetu kude mseu kiwa university ya mwukiwa college pale uko, uko, na, uko na mtichana. It's not a wrong thing. Bora, yeah. unajua the reason, ama unajua why, ama what has made you go into this relationship. Actually, actually vile umemensho, nime kumukwa kuna auntie yangu. Yes. <laughs> wali mari, ule mseo, walikuwa. Walikuwa shule. Wali, eh, walikuwa kiku campus, because mm. I used to go and visit them. But I think it actually happened, wato walikuwa focused. Na ah, wote walipata jobs kwa. Exactly. Kuwa. Unajua hakuna bile tunaweza kuwa na date, mini kwa hii level na huko. So, in, 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 actually, wapa. inategemea na bati yeah, ya. So, I think, pateni <laughs> grades poa, yes. no compete huku nje. Yeah. Unajua, nice. kwa za naangali, unajua hata waso, waso, waso hilo waki date, mm. utadate ule mse vibe yako na vibe yake zinaelewa. Like, yeah. intellectual level iko you are passing in academics. Like, yes. do your best. Ndo hata umu tuwaone, umu tu si shule peke. Mm, Pia mm. kimaisha, Atakuwa, ako focus. Yes. Unajua. Kuna hizo traits uta notice. Hmm. Kama seme ni zile unawana udem alikuwacha ama nini. Hmm. Unajua likuwa nangali hata kama asa waga online. Tinka itago jemo ule mse ama nini. Hmm. Anasema maybe kwa. Ule jemo ule mse. Eh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Musi ya ni content creator. Yeah, 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 yeah. So alikuwa nasema kwa, kwa excess wake ya melano wame mu improve. So ni musema vitu, vitu mingi, mingi uneza, uneza kwa, kwa, my, kwa mental friend. Hmm. Iku help. Yes. Unajua. And so um, how does... Uh, you know, because at the end of the day, campus relationships affect the mental stability of someone, mm. whether man or woman. Yes. Unakumka sture yule jama. Alienda aka aka uwa campus student who kule lore. Yes. Because relationships affect the affect mental, the mental health, health of somebody. Yes. Because yeah. uh, ina 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 vinyo mesema. Uh, inakuwa nga very tricky wakati muna date mkiwa campus alafu uh, unajua ude miyako ni wako alafu wanze kuona natembia na beshte, ya, beshte yako mm. inakuwa a big issue mm. one thing minataka kuambia mse yako campus pale mse yako kole na na date hapo mm. don't put much focus ama much attention on this relationship hata kama unampenda focus on what brought you there vinyame sema na kubaliana at least mu try mu make it mu, mu work hard to a point mutakuwa almost on the same level cause at the end of the day uh, mimi niki focus na, na wewe kila wakati tunuenda out eh, tuna live life yetu kama couples na kila kitu mm. you won't be able to concentrate ama to Talk achieve distraction yes utakuwa uta able to achieve uko na hiki kitu na danganyanga watu leto ni ni couple goals couple goals wewe ulisikia wapi alafu hata ndo umesema umesema time for hashtag ulisikia wapi cause ulienda shule couple goals ama education education ulisikia wapi couple goals ungeenda University of Dating. Lakini sahi jimuat. Oh. Jimuat. Nenda University of Science. Sahi. Sahi. Sahi wa kapo gozi nakuja. Wazi nakuja juu ya social media. Noja sahi tuko ina different generation. Tuko kwa hii modern society. Na kuna watu wengi wako Instagram wako mtandao. Wanaona vile umse anaishi. Kama tse anaona rama. Kwa pale na demi yake ama certain celebrity. Kwa pale ame post dem. Kwa like hey mima zi anataka kuishi. So wewe kama kijana wako campus. Unataka kufulfill ama kufresha udem vinyo umeona social media media. Sao unaenda unanzadi kuiba, unanza kuji engage kwa vitu zenye hazifai, ndi uweza ku, ati kusustain uu life ya udemu. Yo mm. kufuata life ya msi kwa social media, yes. ni ya bit fake. Ni kama mm. vile filter waga. Yes. Maju uneza angalia mtu kwa, kwa Instagram, alafu kini tina ye, tofauti. So, I, I think, wase wengi ufake, hata sisi mm. kwa industry. Yes. Mm. Studio ili kuwaga pale kalif, kando ni majengo, unajua, like, mm. odi, odi, odi. Unaza dhani kalif ni place ingine, bigi ya ili kuwa gani humble beginnings actually hizo ndizo zili tu zili tu keep grounded unajua mm -hmm. hata ukiangalia mtu kama jua kali bado ni ule mse atakugotea roho yes. safi yes. mimi nikipata na mafanzo wangu nitawagotea roho safi because like see do ili kuchange unajua ni yes. hiyo art 
una una appreciate watu walikupenda hiyo art unajua lakini like, social media inaza affect haji uh, mental health ya msi because cause mm-hmm. mm-hmm. inakuge expectations fake so, yes umse mlikuwa mna hustle na yeye mm-hmm. anaenda anachukua kaa haya una muona ame post so uko like wow umse aliomo aliomoka mimi na need pia kuomoka huo mse anaenda anai anaiba alafu Uki sailo umebambo na makarao mm. uko like when you liba eh nilikuwa nataka kufikia life ya umse mm. alafu unapata umse pia yuko huku ndani yes. kumbe alikuwa na fake it ana fake it unajua demand unajua mimi sema kitu moja mimi sema kitu mimi mwambie wase hivi mm. na those who are watching me right now na wewe ni kijana pale wewe maybe ni young pale tuko pale unataka unataka story ya couple goals vitu wase wanafanya social media ku live your lifestyle mimi mwambie wase hivi hebu andika mahali ama usikize social media people post for you want what they want you to see in social media people post for you what they want you to see wana kuwekeanga kitu wanataka wewe uone lakini kwa ground in their personal life hawatakueke hawatakueke the luxury part of it lakini waki waki wakienda na mashida nini zikiwa nini zikiwa chapa hawatakuwekea so hiyo social media influence haifai kukudeteriorate unapata unakuwa depressed ramu watu wengi wanakuwa ngaa depressed na social yeah. media ana feel mbona bana rama anavaa suti bana na mimi navaa tu ma jeans hapo ma sneaker kwa nini suti ni pesa ngapi bana hiyo pressure hata unataka kuvaa suti kama ramu kama gym watu gym watu amepiga stand moja hatari mimi sijai mimi naona ngatua sio kupiga stand mbona ni si afford vile gym watu amedunga lakini imagine mimi natamani kuvaka look relaxed cause one thing nili notice mm. kulingana na hata tuseme e advancement ya technology yes. kuna mtu anaweza kuwa anapigaga job yake kwa social media yeah. kuna mm. ah ah jama au fanyaga bloggers No no, blo- no no bloggers other yeah. bloggers bado wana, wana get unajua mimi naiangalia from monet, monet, monetizing angle mm. yes mm. like kama unaweza monetize social media yako mm. youtube ah, kama, kama udem sa ile best yango kuongo alitoa utawezana ule dem alitoa utawezana chani kuna uh, the aziad aziad yes. like she monetize is those clips and everything yes. mm. unajua like ni kama job unajua job mboka acha nikufunze shengu mpya mboka mboka ni job mboka mboka ni job yeah so, so yeah. like mboka kama sana saidi tuko mboka sasa tuko mboka wewe uko wewe uko mboka au mimi uko mboka sasa tuko mboka cuz ni ni pia kusaidiana and everything so naweza naweza isema wase wengi wana fake it yes so yeah. kuna ile vaku hata sisi tukianza kama kalif yeah. tungeenda tu high venue unajua tuta shoot video ati vile vile tuko na bash mm. kwa ghetto tutaenda tu hae keja yeah, nini keza, yeah. so unajua mna fake it na inshallah tukapata hizo vitu and everything mm. but naweza sema bale ya ku fake it till you make it work on making it yes. unajua make it till you make it no. don't fake it till you make, make it, it. Make it give, till you make it still an, 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 another scenario while in campus kukula mm. kuna venye um, and, and in, in this I'm, I'm referring to you no know, body weight yeah. body size you know because it, it, it's in campus where people get to either know who they are self identity yes. or not your time don unataka kuwa na body shape aina fulani maybe uh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> ka wendi chali mara mara mademo nakwambia oh hatutaki you kitambi tutaka ka body size ya frank just gym it <laughs> yeah <laughs> You know as I love you cool when you come when you affect me say and then when I get into depression mm. when I, you yes. get into yeah. issues of you know bad f- eating habits yes. just because of you feeling insecure with your body one thing rama ame nataka kuambia wase on that issue ya uh, mambo ya body uh, how your body looks una feel ni kama ukipost picha watakujudge mm. eh, lakini unataka tu kwa yes unataka kwa social media ama yeah. whichever place but unaona wase watakujudge one thing usema it all has to do with your, your, your self esteem unajua kuna watu wanakuanga na self esteem issues and you should accept eh, people are different rama uh, mm-hmm. watu wako yeah. different watu wanakuanga na self kuna watu wako na high self esteem about yeah. themselves kuna watu wako na high confidence on themselves lakini kuna watu so self esteem yao inakuwa tricky yeye yeah, iko juu na nyingine iko chini sasa yeah. uh, one thing about the body one thing nataka kuambia mse yako hapo maybe unaogopa wase watafikiria uh, watafikiria vinye unakaa watakujudge but one thing uh, just show appre- appreciate your body enda pale asubuhi yes asubuhi ukiamka enda pale kwa kio kabla utoke kwa nyumba 
enda pale kwa kio jiangalie ji admire unajua kio eh, tunasemanga kio kama una confidence uende mm. uongea na kio unapatanga unaanza kuwa na that confidence <laughs> so enda pale kwa kio jiangalie your body mm. hata kama uko na kitambi kama meja vya unasemanga pia na kitambi utawezana hata kama body yako inakaa sijui aje and you want that ka flat tummy you want that ka uh, v shaped uh, the, the number nane shape mm. and you feel like uh, maybe uko na ile pressure ati hata chali yangu maybe hanipendi juu vile nakaa ama maybe demi yangu anipendi juu niko na kitambi accept yourself yeah. and please kama unaona uh, people will judge you ama people will talk ill of you kuwa positive mimi sema number one thing positivity na kuanga the main yeah. thing everything ukiwa na positivity mindset that how I say atawa kifikiria whatever yeah. they'll think it doesn't define who I am what, what, the way I am ni vile goal ni create body shaming is a big problem, a big problem. Issue, ni issue ni huh. huh. issue mimi mimi naweza lightly hapo tu to judge unajua uh. like i think issue wa gani wewe una judge yes. but basically watu watawagi hiyo zone unajua mtu atakumit muongea alafu maybe wewe unafikiria ati ah maybe niko niko hivi hmm. na hivi na hivi but it, it, it's all eh, in like, your mind it's all in the mind cause mostly okay if 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 ina ku stress sana maybe you need to check or, or if if uko unhealthy ama hmm. uko nini but issue ni Um, like vile alikuwa anasema kama vile tulikuwa nilikuwa tulikuwa naongea juu ya addiction ile time mm. nilikuwa nakumbuka point ya moderation mm. even if it's it's like usifanye kitu sana mm. unajua mm. like too much so, too much of something is poisonous, poisonous. Mm. so like if can health wise unaweza moderate, moderate. Kuna, kuna, ku, ku, there, there is this lady I, i know maybe there is someone watching who is having such kind of insecurities yes. yeah. utapata kama ni dem and i feel like my chest is too big Mm. my 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 nini hips thighs. are too big yes. my thighs are too big mm. am I, am, am, am i too tall yes. am i too short am i, I have a big tummy mm. insecurity yeah in, uko insecure macho yeah. yangu yuko aje mapo mm. yangu masikio mm. siyo nini and, and, and you feel like fitting in is a problem and that's why some of the campus ladies that we have get into medically induced Uh, uh, you know systems to yeah, alter yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, their body their yeah. body yes. is it a mental thing is it about mental health that we need to look into uh, ram uh, vinye nilisema the other time mm. our mind ni kama saa we can tune our mind when you naweza toa saa pale uset kama ni saa sita saa ni saa sita lakini saa yako inasema ni saa 10 we can tune our mind it's yeah. all about the, the tuning mindset if uko hapo maybe una feel uh, body yangu haifai unataka kwenda gym waanze kujidunga steroids waanze kuunga ukuwe kama Calligraf Jones uh, maybe unaona kama Eriko Mondi ume, ume, ume slim kama Eriko Mondi unataka kuanza unaona Eriko maanza ku so uko like eh hey, mbanze mimi niliona ngine ya huyu jamaa mwana na kwa na tisa ni ndo ngani Uh, flaco 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 eh flaco flaco eh flaco flaco hata ukikuwa inspired utatakuwa kama umse but kuwa na reasonable goals unajua like uwezi enda uangalie Arnold Schwarzenegger mm. then uko like atakapo kama Arnold mm. Schwarzenegger huo mm. msemebi alichukua 20 years ku kukaa na yeye alikuwa na goal ya kwenda Hollywood mm-hmm. ama kuingia kwa weightlifting wewe sasa unakuwa hivyo ndio uende kwa ofisi yes ndio kwa goals zina ziko reasonable na dreams zako yes there's one thing me tell was say one thing in a quote ama in something that is real number one, comparison is a thief of thief of joy comparing yourself with someone is the thief of joy you won't be happy once you start comparing yourself with mtu kama ram ama jimwat or me at unataka kuishi lifestyle kama yangu comparison is a thief of joy so live your life naenda na pesa yako mimi nasema nga hivi i won't be religious but let me tell you something time ya god ikifika bro ama sis itafika itafika cheza na pesa yako enda pole pole hata kama it will take 10 years it will take 5 years for you to reach where you want to reach mm. don't compare yourself with somebody just because you want to live their lifestyle chenye oh. chenye anthony amesema yes. naweza sema mimi mimi naweza sema cause I, i went through a hard a hard process kufika place niko humble and everything mm-hmm. so naweza sema nilikuwa na harakisha life sana yes. unajua mm. like hata kuna time ninge kuwa niko bukla bukla ni club niko club hiyo mm-hmm. club maybe ni VIP mm-hmm. so hata ile classic huko ni, ni, ni watu wame wanakula retirement life yao sasa yes. yule mzana kuza kwani una jiwest kijana mdogo si hizi pesa usave nani then unajua mlevi waga ile kwani nakunywa pesa zako yani hadi kurudi <laughs> kurudi kwa wazai wao yeah, yeah, yeah. but yani kuna mzai aliniambia <laughs> like yeah. asiyefunzwa na mama atafunzwa na ulimwengu hizo vitu zinakuja kukuhapenia like ground. life yes. ilinipiga stop 
So mu semaga peleka life na pace na pole pole. So ina na yendo shida ni mayutsoe ngi akona yao. Pressure no manato la kuna bio sana. Yes. Alafu wana fuata mtu maybe ata juu kuli ana yenda kuna 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 preacher ali semaga. Life lini ambo la dipo nda church ni saidiya. Kuna preacher ali ali semaga ali kuana fuata mathiri ili amepote amepote ana hipa jam. Yes. Sana fuata mathiri. Juma tiri wazi lepanga. Eh, eh, ina hipa jam. So, mm. ana GMB itamtoa kwa main road pali ya mm. mehipa jam. Yes. Alipata matiri mende imepaka. Kumbu ule msali kwa nenda home. <laughs> so, <laughs> musifu wata mtu na ujuku kule ya naenda. Mbuna naenda. Yes. Yes. Ah, like. Yoki ito maini fajikia. <laughs> Ram, unajua, uh, pia kuna hii quote. Do not, compare, ah. do not compare your chapter 20. Uh, don't, do not compare somebody else's chapter 20 with your chapter 1. Mm. It doesn't mean ati uwe mtu mwenye una watch. Uh, it'll take a day. Na maybe uko hapo, you're a campus student unataka ku, kuanza life. Ama maybe uko hapo nje, not only campus students. Uko hapo, when youth man, unataka kuanza life, uweke biashara, you grow, uh, na, na uko stable in financial, in whatever way. Let me tell you something. Usi, 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 usi kwe nambio. Take time. Pole pole. Unajua one thing. Patience, perseverance. Patience and perseverance. I want, building us, I want, I want us to, to, to take another, another scenario here. Yes. yes. Pesa. Pesa. Mamba ya dondo ina affect kwa tuwa kampu. Pesa. Pesa. Mm. Utapata msea, anasema, <laughs> and it was very interesting when I had one, 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 one particular lady mm. who is uh, in college mm. saying that, and I'm not a sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's a, that's a bad thing, because my indiaki ya mesha afkiria, iyo ndo kitu chantua pali, iyo ndo jani kisha pali ya kuenda. So her, her mental frame is, mm. is mbaya, because Kwa nini, amejuliza kwa nini anataka sponsor? Mse mwenye kukole, anafafu adila jine mwame pesa. Because hapo, hiyo nata ya mwenye msa, anasema anataka kuget into business. Unangia biyashara, anataka kuget into something patience. legal. Atapata hizo vitu, akikuwa patient na awak on goals zake. Perseverance. Because mm. it's a yes. stairs. Unajua? Mm. Wantaka kupanda kama elevator. Shida ya kupata kama, kupanda kama elevator, utashuka kama elevator. Exactly. Shida ni yao. Ukipanda kama bio. stairs, mm. Mm. uta appreciate sa ilu unafika first floor, second floor, third floor but imagine umetoka first floor umeenda 10th floor wow. na pia inaweza kuama ni process elevator inaweza kuama na ikikuama psychology status kwa nimefikiria elevator ile ile kaende kaende wewe umesema vitu vingine ati ukipanda kama elevator utashuka kama elevator kama elevator the same easy thing easy come easy go easy come easy go yeah. yes okay different scenario here nataka tuende miombio <laughs> um kuna there there's there this family pressure yeah utapata mzaya anakuambia mimi nataka ufanye hii mm Mother pia anasema ataka ufanya hii. Mm. In effect mind ya, ya, ya yeah. mtoi. Ina mge pressure, ina pressure. Yeah. Mm. Ha, u, mta nafaa fanya aji hivina kukule? Uh, acha, acha ni chukwe sinari yako niweke in, in terms of mtu mwenye ako saia memaliza high school. Halafu mzae anamuambia fanya medicine. Halafu mother anamuambia fanya fashion. Lakini ye mwenye wa ataka fanya engineering. So there are three different courses hapo. Buda nataka ufanya medicine, ukwe doki, maybe yeni doki. Yeah. Mother nataka ufanya fashion, juu yeni fashion designer. Lakini yeah. we mwenye nataka kuwa electronic engineering. One thing ni wambia wase. Ni sawa, wazee wako ndo wanakulipia fee. Ni sawa, unaiza chukua help. With the help of your parents getting you to the university or the college. But one thing ni usema, follow your heart. Mi bro, kuna, kuna sinari unapata, mzae mekombi ufanya medicine na mzae mekombi ufanya fashion. Usiana umepiga medicine miaka sita, umefanya degree yako, misha maliza. Mm. Alafu, umse ya misha maliza medicine, anachukua hiyo sat, anapeleke mbuyu. Ni aje, ndo hii sat yako. Uli nyambe mm. nifanya medicine, nisha fanya. But mimi anataka fanya nini? Engineering. Madhe, anataka fanya fashion. Na hame insist fanya fashion. Na hame sema, usipofanya fashion design, sita kulipia school fees, sita kulipia mali unaishi kama ni hostel ama nje. Fanya aje. Enda basi. Kama hame kupush, kwa mzazi pia na kujanga na blessing. Kama hame kupush, yeah. fanya yo fashion, anataka utafanya two years. Chukua. Patia mzazi. Lakini we mwenye wataka fanya engineering. Now the parents will come to think. Hata itakuwa lesson kwa mm. other, other parents. Hata maperu wa kienda nja utakuwa naambia. Mini le push mtu yuango fanya fashion na fanya uh, medicine. Lakini mingi wataka fanya engineering. Right. Yo pressure inakuanga mbaya sana. Nataka tumalzi ya history na hapa hivi. Time meisha. Mm. <coughs> na, 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 na iyo time watu wana waste. Ndo kitu valuable kuliku hata do. That's mm. why nasema hata iyo ikifika iyo point unataka sponsor. Saa uo sponsor obviously ana, ana use kitu kwa kwa. Unajua? Mm. Mm. Yes. Na kama alikupata kampo akimaliza na ukitoka kampo atende ya mwingi mwingine mwingine so una, una, depend on mtu haizi kusaidi kusaidia so yeah. jisaidie depend you know, you know, on yourself you yes. know it's interesting because some of these campus girls tapata um, um, you've met with some old guy yeah. and akulipia school fees you know you love to pay for it but anyway uh, i want us to to wrap it up like this um in your own view, within just 30 seconds, yes. your final word to someone who is watching you, and also you can give us just a tip, one tip each, on what someone 
uh, should do in order for them to notice uh, an individual who is having a mental health issue while still in school. Just to wrap it up, your final word. Uh, so what I'd like to say, first of all, is uh, mental health illness, I'm a mental health problem, some disorder is very, very serious. Now what when you kunja wanna wanna go through such issues. Depression is one of the major, major key of it because depression is leading it to suicide. So one thing I'd like to tell you, in order for you to get yourself away, ama kwa depression, do you fall into that thing, uh, into that trap, put your mind first kuna ile positivity ama kuna that mindset that mm -hmm. this is this is a very very serious issue na nataka kujiondoa alafu one thing i'd like to tell people uh, ram and uh, jimwat wase waache pressure take life to pole pole vile inakuja mm -hmm. usikuwe na mbio ya life Uraja life yende mahali mental health issue yeah utajoje msa kuna mental health oh yeah nilikuwa nikuja hapo number one. Kama huni mse mwenye mliko mnaenda out na yeye na mabeshte, alafu wameanza kuji keep distance, hataki kuji involve na activities. Kama alikuwa mse wa futa, mse wa kuswim, lakini imefika mahali, mse hata aji involve. Kama ni mtu waliacha job, lakini haku sema reason as to why aliacha job. Some of these things, ile silent, ame alikuwa whatsapp, ame draw, ame draw whatsapp, everything, mm -hmm. that's how you can nini. Alafu one thing I'd like to tell them ni kemalizia. Yeah. So check up on your friends. Nika, nika ama mse apige tu about turn. Yes. Right. Alikuwa naenda hii lane, alafu apige about turn. Yes. Nataka ne, ne, tukia kwa kwa kujima tu kemalizia. About mental, mental issues. Yes. The, the, it's real. Mm. So mina sema, like, kwanza usi judge mtu ama useme, like, umse ni cheesy ama nini. Yes. Tafta what caused him to be that way, if okay. he wasn't born mentally, mm -hmm. like ill. Right. Na uneza angalia, uneza angalia what you're feeding. Ni kama saa ukipi, ukipika kitu fulani. You put the right ingredients, mm -hmm. itaiva vile unataka. Vile unataka. Mm -hmm. You put the wrong ingredients. Mm -hmm. Ayezi iva vile unataka. Right. Yes. Thank you so much, Jimot. Yeah. And uh, Anthony. Yes. Um, yes. Um, one thing that nataka, unabe, ukona project? Una... Yeah, nikona, nikona project. Like, after this, I was going for a meeting, see you have Upper City Park, mm -hmm. in, a, in a welcome anybody who wants to, to, to addiction and recovery, okay. like to na to na jitaga C12, so it's about the community na 12 steps of so, recovery. Wow, 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 wow! Guys, thank you so much for 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 being part of this conversation. I cannot be able to start to, to read all of your feedback on our social media handles, but I want to appreciate you for being part of this show. I was with the Jim Wizzy, Jim What Happy if you can just Jim What Edutainment, Edutainment Social Handles. Social Handles. Yeah. Ensure that you engage with him. Yeah. Uh, also, Anthony, Anthony Jenga. Uh, Anton, Anthony Jenga. Official Anthony Jenga Instagram. Official Anthony Jenga. Yes. Guys, it's a pleasure. Shukran. Thank, thank you so much. I end with a quote as always. And uh, this is what I'm saying. Uh, 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 to, today as we bring this to a close mental health starts with you if you take care of your mind you take care of, of the world so invest in your mental health and claim the power back wow. and that is what brings us to the end of this morning morning show my name is Ram Aguko this is Power Talk Talk your power yeah <laughs> <laughs>